This makes me want to go scuba diving like this. Ow. my channel I am ocean for those of you who are new here and today's video is gonna be a bikini weenie try on haul slash undie try on haul because I figured they're kind of in the same category so why not just combine them okay and that's what we're gonna do today so let's jump into see first I don't think I like this one I really don't I do like the fact you can adjust it and make the hips go higher or lower whatever the heck and bob you want but it's just really not flattering for my body type and the back keeps doing this thing where the white part pops out and I'm just not here for it so let's get to the next this one is a lot more flattering I do like it but again, I'm running into the same issue that the white under is popping through, like flipping around in the nooks and crannies, which I don't like. I wish bikini companies would make the inner fabric the same color as the outer. So if it does move and groove, it's not a problem and it won't really be noticed. But this one is very, very flattering, like I said. The back, do you see what I mean? How the white keeps popping out right there? I don't love that look and I wish this was hugging a bit like tighter. It gives me no support. It does hug my curves though. I'm not mad at this one. I actually think this one is probably my favorite so far besides for black for the color category. I think this one is a 10 out of 10. Uh, nine out of 10 just because of that white lining like I said, duh, next. I'm definitely a fan of this one. It feels like a romper, not really a swimsuit, but it's a thousand percent a swimsuit. It has the whole material shebang a woo. So I didn't see it before when I was shopping and purchasing this online, but it reminds me of the old school bikinis, bikinis, one pieces that they would wear to the beach, you know, with the little shorts. Oh, that is actually really cute. And I hope that style could come back because nowadays, I don't know why we dress the way we do, but... I mean, I guess. This is cute. I would wear this. And I would actually wear this out like an outfit, not just a bikini. So we love the versatility. Next. I really don't know what I was thinking. Uh, the last one, I thought I was in the 50s. This one, I guess I'm in the 70s. What the heck was I thinking? I just wanted to try a wild card. I know what I was thinking. I want to see maybe something else would be flattering, but I don't like it. <laughs> This is the part that I was most excited for, the open back I thought would be very, very flattering and different, but I'm just not a fan of the loud print. It's too loud. I do love the openness. I do think I'm going to pass on this one. Next. Do I love it or do I hate it? I don't know. The front is iffy, but the back I am obsessed with. I just wish the front I loved more. It has a lot going on and nah. But the back, wow. Don't say I didn't warn you for a while because this is the most different, unique bathing suit I've ever seen in my entire stinking life. And it is gorgeous, flawless, phenomenal. All of the wows. I just, I can't. This is ah, everything. I wish I created this bikini. I wish I did. But I cannot think of it for what is not mine. <laughs> The front of this is in, but the back makes up for it. Phenomenal, oh, I just love everything about it. Let's go ahead and get to Z next. This one is actually quite nice, very different, and it's not giving bikini or bathing suit, but I'm kind of very comfortable in it. I don't feel like nothing's gonna fall out. I feel like I could go run, go take a swim, and everything is gonna be in place. I actually love this one. The back is just basic as heck. It's not really hugging right here at all. Dang it, it's kind of cute. And I like the fact that you can zip it up right here as well. So if you don't want to show more, but I want to show more. I think it's more flattering when you have just a little bit showing. You get me? <laughs> but let's go ahead and get to the next. I know this isn't a bikini, but it is technically because brown undies are bikinis, but I got some skin dupes. 
Please tell me you guys have seen those TikToks. It's like, do okay. Anyways, you you get it. If you get it, you get it. If you don't, you don't. I don't know what to tell you. But I actually think these are very flattering in the front. Just the back is giving me grandma vibes. I wish it was a thong style. Hopefully the next ones, I got it in that style. But these are way cheaper than the one she offers. And I think they look just as good. And they're really good quality. So I'm not mad. I think this was a good buy. <laughs> and they were like a third of the price, which makes me even happier. Let's try the next. Yep, these ones are so nice and the back of them is even better than the last because no fancy lines. I love, why the heck in Bob is anyone buying skims for like $80 for a pair of chonies? Y'all are out of your minds. This is why y'all go broke. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not in charge of your finances. If you want to do it, do it. Life is too short. Who gives a damn? I don't. The back is just amazing. I love, I am obsessed. Look at that waist. They're so flattering. Okay, next. So that is going to conclude today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, bye!